Uh, you know, how Pink Floyd fans ever came to, <laughs> to formulate you know, the philosophy that somehow it was all to do with outer space and whatever, which happened earlier. It had something to do with the fact that one song was called Interstellar Overdrive, you know, and another song was called Astronomy Domine. Both subsidies, both compositions subsidies. And I, and I think they thought that because he went, <laughs> like that, that, it must mean it was about <laughs> celestial laws. Like, you know, it was never about anything but inner space. Even Sid's song, I think, it was about personal experience. <laughs> to do with the firmament. Right. <laughs> to do with the firmament. Right. That's all. So I, I can't, I can't explain it.
Let's make sure we keep talking.
you um, how, how do you account for the association that the album has with drug use? I've no idea. I've no idea. It's not for me to answer. I've d I, I just, I don't know. Uh, you know, how Pink Floyd fans ever came to, um, <laughs> to formulate, uh, you know, the philosophy that somehow it was all to do with outer space and <laughs> whatever, which happened earlier. <laughs> I think it had something to do with the fact that one song was called Interstellar Overdrive, you know. And another song was called Astronomy Domine. Both subsid, both composition subsids. It's about personal experience and has nothing to do with the firmament. <laughs> right. That's all. So I, I can't I can't explain any of that. I'm frankly sorry.